Uh, hi, my name is Justin Gray. I am the drama teacher, one of the drama teachers for Brooklyn High School of the Arts, uh, and we have had Emit come to our school twice now, uh, both times to present uh, immersive Shakespeare. Um, but I want to share two memories that I had that were really awesome from uh, their production of Romeo and Juliet that they did at our school in 2020. It was actually one of the last things, the last pieces of theater that happened in our school. Um, and there was two big memories that still stick with me. Um, the, the first was um, uh, one of my students who uh, had a lot of sort of uh, behavioral challenges, you know, going into the year um, and was someone who had a lot of trouble sitting still. And because of that, you know, going to theater sometimes was hard for her. Um, and a lot of times we would sort of have issues. And she showed up to the show. Uh, she was late. Um, she was about five minutes late, um, which didn't surprise me. Um, but and she was not really looking forward to it because it was Shakespeare, and so she wasn't super excited. But I I tried to just encourage her to have an open mind, um, and I found her again about twenty minutes later having the time of her life at the masquerade party, um, uh, amongst all of the other characters, um, and following uh, Mercutio around wherever she went. Um, she just like it blossomed into a whole new person. Um, and I have pictures still of her, like living it up at the party um, and living her best life. And that was really, really awesome to see. Um, and another memory from that same show that really jumped out to me was uh, I remember at one point looking over and seeing two of my students, Jonathan and Jessica, who I would never uh, really ever see having a conversation with each other. They just sort of ran in different circles. Um, and, you know, they were never in groups together. They never really worked on anything together. But for some reason, the two of them were standing there um, at the party with uh, Lord and Lady uh, 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 Capulet, um, as well as Tybalt there, just sort of like talking shop about the party and talking about the business as if they were all nobles and uh, going along with the role play. Um, and it was really cool to see how, uh, the immersive work that Emit presents could sort of create this really uh, interesting and unique shared experience uh, for the ensemble that could bring together two kids who, for whatever reason, just never had you know a reason to interact before then. Um, so that's why I think that Emit is awesome, and uh, they should get all of the money in the world. So uh, yeah, thanks guys.